Hey there, thanks for tuning into Duck Bricks. I'm Chris and welcome to Lego Mini Reviews, the show where I review a ton of different Lego vintage and new sets right here on the Duck Bricks YouTube channel in a short form format. So I have a ton of Bricklink orders to get through as well as just associated Lego purchases and I figured instead of making a mega video where I go through every single one that's hours long, why not break it up into separate mini reviews? And so in addition to our normal three videos a week schedule, be be sure to stay tuned for a mini review dropping every single day where we do not normally have a standard video releasing. I hope you enjoy and let's jump right into our first pick. Now this is a wacky set and is probably one of my favorite, if not my absolute favorite, Fright Nights Lego set. So this is Willow the Witch's airship. You can see Willow right here, and it is an airship like a hot air balloon, except it is powered by a flying dragon. What a fun concept is that? So this is just a really fun design for a model, incredibly simple, it uses only a few pieces with a large hot air balloon style bottom piece right here. You've got some axes to swing at the front to maybe chop any other people's aircrafts as they pass by, a crystal ball for Willow the Witch to presumably steer the ship with and of course the large single dragon mold up at the top here which is completely making this entire aircraft fly this is a lovely concept for a lego build i really like how that when you tilt it the dragon more or less stays upright so you can really imagine that it is truly flying in the air and it's honestly just one of those wacky 90s lego castle designs that they probably wouldn't do nowadays but absolutely was just a very fun set to play around with in general i love the willa figure and although the cape is pretty tacky you can still see that it has the spider design on the back. You've got some nice detailing around each of the edges of the plane itself with some of the backing lights. I like to think these are brake lights on the back, so just kind of a fun concept for a model in general. Nothing too crazy I can say about here. Always good to get the dragon mold in a specialized set because this is one of the most classic Lego animals. And I love the inclusion of the wings simply mounted on clips to really make this feel like a very whimsical Lego model. Will the Witch may have been one of the more villainous characters from Lego Castle lore, but man, did she know how to travel in style. So that was the very wacky and wild Witch's Windship from the world of Lego Fright Nights. Let me know down in the comments below what did you think of this model. I hope you enjoyed this mini review. It definitely is one of the most charming, strange Lego castle sets where they really were trying to blend fantasy and castle together. I actually really like the concept. I know not a lot of people might be fans of it because it's kind of very out there and looks very odd, but I think it is quite a fun Lego set. And it's just really funny imagining a hot air balloon type contraption, but instead being towed by a dragon. With that, we have summed up this mini review. Thank you all so much for tuning in to Duck Bricks and like and subscribe for even more LEGO news, reviews, discussion, and analyses coming your way very soon. Bye for now.